Hello, Enviro students, and welcome to your last official week of environmental science. We're just going to finish up working on the presentations that you guys did your research for last week. I'm going to take you guys through a couple of video creation resources that you can use. Before we go over those, I just want to point out again, if you guys need any help, here are the two links for our PLTs this week. Please jump on if you need any assistance or have any questions about the assignment. So as you guys prepare to take the research that you compiled on Friday and create a presentation, I've got a couple of resources for you guys to use if you would like. So first thing, uh, look at number three in the agenda here. Uh, you'll see that there is a partial presentation. So I just used a Google Slides presentation and created a sample from Cole. So this presentation is simply just Google Slides. I went through and I just created a slide for each question that was answered. So you guys can see this is coal, which was my non-renewable energy source. Uh, what is coal or the description of coal? Where is coal found? Um, can coal be used in Illinois? And then the last one goes into strengths and weaknesses. If you guys like this template, you feel free to copy this presentation and use it to make your own. Or if you guys want to use a Prezi or any kind of presentation, if you want to make your own poster and then just present it in Flipgrid, you are also welcome to do that. But this kind of gives you guys an idea of what we're looking for. What we're going to be grading you guys on is the information in these presentations. So we're looking for you guys to answer all of these questions and then we can give you guys points for that. Okay, now there's a couple of ways you guys can present your information. So once you have your presentation made, one of the resources you guys can use is right on Schoology. If you'd like to use WeVideo, you guys can just click on it right into the left-hand column of our class page. You can launch it, and then you can create a video if you want to use just a standard if you want to just, if you just want to use a standard slides presentation, you can click just record. You guys can collect, you guys can select your screen. If you want to keep yourself in the image, you can do your screen and webcam. You'll have to allow it to have access to your microphone and your camera. And then once you get started, you click on the window that you want to use. I want to do my sample presentation and it will go straight to that presentation. If you want to click present, it'll just do the, it will just record the presentation itself and then you can just talk over and kind of tell us what's on your slides. And then when you're done, just click on the stop and then you guys can You can go on to your WeVideo and click save, and then you guys can work on doing the edits in WeVideo. When you're done, click finish. Give it a title. And then when you hit this point, you guys are gonna wanna upload it to your drive. So right here, it's gonna say Google Drive. If you guys are going through Schoology, you'll have access to all of these file points, so please go ahead and use that. If you want to upload it to YouTube, um, you could, but I would suggest uploading it to your Google Drive, and then you guys can upload it directly to Flipgrid, which I'll show you guys next. If you don't like using the video, Flipgrid is also another option, so I'll bring up Flipgrid and show you how you guys can record in that. Okay, you guys have one more option for doing your presentation recording. So if you come back to your main assignment and scroll down, you guys will see 
Um, there is instructions for Flipgrid down here, and this kind of goes over how you can upload your video. I'll go over that as well. To get into Flipgrid, what you guys need to do is click on the link, which you guys will see. What you guys need to do is click on the link for your group. You'll find all your names in a chart just below these instructions. Um, when you get into Flipgrid, you're going to be asked to log in. Log in with Google and then just use your school email, so your ID number and your at Lake Forest Schools, and that will get you guys into the Flipgrid. So down here, you guys can see all of your names. Those are all your Flipgrid links. So once you click on one, when you guys log on to Flipgrid, it will look like this. You just click in the blue little button here that says log in with Google. Click your school account and you'll come to this screen. In order to post your presentation, scroll down, click this plus button, and it will bring up a screen. Okay, so there's a button to do a recording right from your computer, and then there's two other options. If you guys do a video through WeVideo or iMovies, you have an upload button. You just click the upload, and from here, you can click directly on the center screen, and then just click your video or select it from your Google Drive. If you do it on WeVideo, you can always download the MP4 file to your computer and then just upload it. Or it says you can drag over the file. That is one way to do it. If you would like to present a poster or something of that nature, you guys can click the center button and do a presentation right here. Is click. If you would prefer to do your recording using Flipgrid, there's these three dots to the left. If you click on that and then click screen recording and then start screen recording, you can choose the screen that you would like to use. So I'm going to, again, click my slide presentation and then click share. And that takes me right to my presentation. Again, you can click present and it will go into a full screen mode. When you have completed doing your presentation, you can click that stop button you guys see at the top of the screen, and then you will have your video. So that's what you guys can do if you would like, and then you just click next and you can do your editing right there. I'm going to go the other way and exit out of this. So those are your two ways to upload a video onto Flipgrid. If you guys have, again, any follow-up questions, please let myself know. Uh, just, again, one more reminder. If you need help, PLT is next Wednesday and Friday from 9.30 to 10.30 and 1.15 to 2.30 on Friday. Hope you guys had a great weekend, and we look forward to seeing your presentations this week.